Hi everyone, welcome back to Tokyo on Fire. Today is March 27th, 2018. Sorry we've been off the air for about a month, but we have a lot of catching up to do. A lot is going on politically. We're back on track now, and boy, is there a lot to report to you about what's going on in the Abe administration, what's going on with Moritomo. There are things going on in the diet right now. Michael, you tuned in. Well, we've been watching all day, or at least we've been bored out of our skulls all day by the performance by former tax division chief uh, Sagawa, who has been called into the diet to answer questions about the Moritomo Gakuen scandal. Can you imagine the fear that they must have, the finance minister, the prime minister, what is that guy gonna say tomorrow? He better follow the script. That's what they were probably thinking of as they went to bed last night. Today, they're just sitting back in their chairs. He says, ah, now yeah. that's the kind of thing I like to hear, yeah. which is, the sound of silence. Yes, and uh, as opposed to the Moritomo Gakuen thing that we've been talking about, there's no tit for tat, so it's hard to, to hang a, a, a hook on, on the prime minister. But for this one, there is a tit for a tat. Yeah. I'm not gonna say anything and I, I get to keep my job, maybe. Well, he doesn't get to keep his job, he resigned oh, from that's it. Right. But, but, I mean, and that's I'm right. fairly sure that they're very quick on giving him his pension. Maybe not, maybe that's what, what Abe has over him. But I, mean, I mean, he's resigned, you're right, I apologize. He resigned and so he's, a, he's not a public servant anymore. So He's what a free is, agent, yeah. What is the deal here? You remember the other guy that resigned? Mayakawa. Ma Mayakawa, oh, great guy. Mayakawa, when he was no longer um, officially an official, he, he play, when the uh, opposition asked him questions, are these documents real regarding Kakegaku? And he said, yes. you better believe it. <laughs> I've seen them before. Mm -hmm. uh, and you know, answering all the questions. But today, Sagawa is just saying, I have to, have, I just have to, uh, cannot respond to what you're saying. I can, blah, 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 blah. And he's just, yeah. he's, he's, he's going to become a, a figure of tremendous hatred. Already the, the headlines at noontime from the various news organizations, the partisan ones that are anti-Abe, are just livid mm -hmm. at, at this you know, stonewalling that's going on. So right. in terms of the Moito Mogakuen scandal, there, there are two is issues at hand, uh, which is, okay, what was the reason why the names of the prime minister, his wife, and other politicians, including the finance minister. Expunged. Why were they removed? Right. And who told you to do it? And those are the two questions that matter. Right. And he's not answering either That's of where them. there's a little snip there, and it just dies after that, well, up then, the hierarchy. And, and the thing is, there's, the opposition, of course, really wants, they, they never really wanted to have uh, uh, Sagawa here. They, what they really want is the prime minister's wife. What do you think? And that's never going to happen. Okay. Uh, because Abe has been, he, he has been using his shoulder, using his elbow, whatever he can to keep the questions away from his wife. And in fact said the very absurd thing from a person who's supposedly a feminist. If you have questions to her, ask them to me. Mm -hmm. He sounded full of conviction on Sunday though, didn't he? Oh, when, when there was the party, the party had a party Congress and there was a, a, a bit of tension going into the build-up to that because so many of the uh, potential rivals, like Ishibashige, mm -hmm. the former defense minister, like even Koizumi Shinjiro, Koizumi Shinjiro, who, Shinjiro who, is... who should be thinking about the premiership 10 years from now, not now, mm -hmm. in the build-up to the party Congress started saying uh, things about the, the, the lifespan of this premiership under Abe uh, as being limited and uh, that he really has to think yep. about the future. And many other rivals like Kishida Fumio who have been quiet for the past few months also piped up. And the reason for that, of course, has been Moritomo Gakuen and the absolute crushing of the, the Abe administrations, the Abe cabinets support ratings in all of the polls. It does, it, it, all of the polls, whether from the, the left wing or the right wing uh, dailies have shown absolute nine, 10, 11 point drops in support, right. and the same amount of do not support going up. Mm -hmm. And if looking at just the Kyodo poll, which I get, uh, the, it was a nine point drop, but if you looked at the internal numbers, what was the reason for it? What, was, what really got people into the not support column, the, the biggest jump was in, I do not trust the prime minister. Mm -hmm. Now for the party as a whole, that the prime minister is no longer trusted and it, that is becoming a possible uh, barrier to 
them achieving what they really want to achieve in these one and a half years, which is get a constitutional revision passed, or at least it's not even a, it's a, a year and a three months because in 2019, they faced the House of Counselors election where they might lose the mm -hmm. two-thirds majority that they currently have in that. In that so within that time frame, it, it, it's got to come up. It's, it's got to come up. It's yeah. got to, and, it, and, it, and you have to work backwards in time from that House of Counselors election. Right. You, you have to find a place for that referendum. Maybe and after the LDP election? Maybe after yeah. the LDP election in September, uh, they would need a 60 to 180 day discussion period for the amendment that's mm -hmm. already getting into close to the new year, the new, uh, the new diet session, which will discuss the budget. And then of course, in May of next year, a completely new reign right. era with the abdication of the current emperor and the uh, the coronation. It's not really it's not, they don't put a crown on him mm -hmm. of the uh, of the new emperor. Where do they put that that uh, that referendum in? And where mm -hmm. do they put that that discussion period? And how do they control that discussion right. period? Mm -hmm. If Mr. Abe is in place, we know two things. One. More than 50% of the people do not want to have a constitutional amendment under Abe. And you need 50%. Today. Yeah, today. Today. So, so the trick is, I'm sorry to inter interrupt you. No, you please, that's point. the thing. It, the, the, the trick is to create a groundswell of something else. So he needs something else, and it doesn't look like President Trump is going to give it to him, but he has to create something else that's going to hopefully carry him over. It's on his agenda. Okay, he's got economic growth. He's got... Uh, doesn't have 2% inflation, all these goals that he hasn't met for his uh, Abenex project. Wage increase? Um, he's got, the wage increases are again, he has not been able to get major corporations to shell out the right. money that they have been putting in the bank, giving it to the, either their shareholders or more importantly to their workers. Right. Okay, but it's it's a mixed bag, and it's but it's but it's a period of growth, a long-term period of growth. He, he has that, but he has that, regardless, and any replacement for him would have the same. Mm -hmm. the, the, uh, the, the set of policies are basically reduced down to the Bank of Japan buying anything and having monetary easing. Uh, the, the third arrow, the first arrow, fiscal policy and uh, structural reform have been desultory. Right. They, they haven't gotten any excitement. It's all about the Bank of Japan. Mm -hmm. That'll have be there for anybody who wants to replace him. Right. And in September, there is a, an opportunity. If this drags on and he stays in the 30s in terms of his cabinet support, and if people continuously say, at least 50% of the people continuously say, we will not vote for an amendment, even if it's for, you know, the, the emperor is a great guy. Right. A declaration of that in the constitution, we're not gonna vote for it because Abe is prime minister. Then September looks really uncertain yes, it for does. him. And it's right around the corner. It really is. It, we, we think it's all the way months off, but it's, it's really around the corner, and right. he has got to figure out what it is. Oh, it's possible that North Korea can provide some kind of boost, and mm -hmm. certainly there have been little tiny boosts in his popularity sometimes in regards to missile tests or nuclear right. tests, but that fades away rather quickly. Uh -huh. uh, and. What they need is a sustained cabinet support over 50% to even even consider mm -hmm. the possibility of submitting an amendment, first to a vote in the Diet and then going into this discussion period. Mm -hmm. And the discussion period will be brutal. Many of the, the, uh, the uh, newspapers are highly skeptical of the Abe administration now, and the Asahi Shimbun, which was beaten down, thanks to well, the Moritomo. Well, that's because all the knives are unsheathed. I mean, everybody smells but, the but, blood in the water. But Asahi was silent for the for, for last two years. Mm -hmm. They really effectively neutered them. Right. Uh, but now, it's with the Moritomo Gakuen scandal, which it has played a great part in exposing, it's back to its old strength, and today, yeah. for me, the, the, the real, the, the, the extraordinary thing that happened today was actually just a tiny announcement that NHK made during the, its broadcast of the, uh, regard, it's, it's broadcasting the, uh, the, 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 the diet testimony, but during its newscast, it said, we're not going to use the word kakikai. We're not going to use rewrite for what happened to the documents. We're going to use the word kaizan. 
adulterate or, or, or falsify. Mm -hmm. that, we're not going to use the government's terminology anymore. Okay, they're going a little bit more pejoratively. That, way more pejoratively, and that's NHK. That's NHK. That's yeah. NHK having its Walter Cronkite moment. I do not believe what the government has been telling me. Mm -hmm. I have to go with what is factual. That's mm -hmm. my job. Uh, and that, that tiny shift is what sets the landslide going, right. I think. Right. Because it, that would be, that would be, that's a trigger moment for me. And it's tiny and it's small. It seems stupid that it's just a matter of language. But the use of language in this case creates the mm -hmm. mood. And it's mood that keeps Abe aloft. It's not achievements. Right. It's people saying, I can't see anything better. Mm -hmm. But when the moment comes for him, when they say, we can't take him anymore, the castles, the, the sand that's underneath his castle will just wash away. Right. Michael, you know, we talk about the closing of, of the diet. We talk about the, the collapse of the administration and uh, up for election again. And today there was one person who held that power in his hand. The diet testimony of Sagawa could have gone a different way. And do you not agree that that could have caused a collapse of the administration? It's possible, it w but he would really have to have the, the ability to expose everything. Mm -hmm. uh, and indeed, there would be repercussions for him along the line, and he has to think about his long-term viability. Well, there, are, there are other repercussions. I mean, somebody's already killed himself. That's true. Right? It's true. The, 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 the suicide, uh, seemingly by one of the members, one of the, a finance ministry bureaucrat who... It, seemingly in his suicide memo, he didn't leave a note, he left a memo, said, I'm, I will, everyone's trying to make it my fault right. that the, the documents were, 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 were doctored. Uh, he, yeah, Sagawa immediately resigned after uh, that rep news came out that someone had killed himself. Mm -hmm. uh, the, yeah, he's, he's definitely damaged goods. Now, Mayakawa, in the, from the Ministry of Education, has become now a tribune of the people. And mm -hmm. many people want the bureaucracy to be that. For the longest time in Japan, right. in, in Japan, the bureaucracy was out of touch, was too arrogant, was too far away. We need politicians in charge. Right. And bingo, now with Abe and the change in the personnel laws that That's happened right. in 2014, the politicians are in charge and the people are saying, Whoa! Well, that that kind of that, allowed enabled this this situation that we it, have that, right now. The the Sontaku story is right. the it, the backstory to it is the 2014 mm -hmm. change, which gives the Kante far more power to control the top bureaucrats, right. the, the the careers of the 600 top bureaucrats. In, it, it's always been there. There's been mm -hmm. a bit of power, but not formally and not in, in terms of just absolute con mm -hmm. control. That has changed the dynamic, and the people who are longtime supporters of, you know, tr let's trim, let's let's trim the sails of, of these these Tokyo University graduates right. and their and their they're you know, arrogant. Th they're, they're, so, they're so far above us. The, these people who are up there in the clouds. Now they see, hey, wait, mm -hmm. that 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 ideological position they've always had. We're here to protect the nation and the people. Right. That wasn't a joke. You know, I have a different take on Sagawa. Initially, when we first started talking about this, I thought he was evil incarnate. But as this thing has developed, I think he's a, he's a victim too. How so? Because he, you know, he went to the University of Tokyo. He's cream of the crop. He went into the finance ministry, the pick for graduates. I mean, you have to be not only the top of your class, but the top, top percentile of your class. And then you go through 10 or 15 years of just arduous work in the trenches. And he rose up through that. And he's not going to think of something to do like, like it's being blamed on him. Just out of the blue, it doesn't benefit him. So definitely, he was squeezed. Yes, he took the bait. He resigned as a result of that, but I think he's a victim. I think there are a lot of victims here. This kind, the way the government is run, it's top down. Somebody else in a higher position ordered him under penalty of losing your job or your prestige or whatever. But he was kicked upstairs. He was rewarded for his testimony and last year, which we now know was largely, per, largely okay. doctored, adulterated perjury. Yes, I agree with you, but that, that what's he gonna that, say? What, you know, you're gonna get, okay, you know? Well, the thing is, if he, what he said was the truth and went through exactly everything that was in those original documents, Mr. Abe 
would have been forced to resign because right. Mr. Abe made that pledge in the Diet. If you, exactly. If you find that I or my wife had anything to do with this Moritomo Gakuen land deal, I will resign not only as Prime Minister, but as a member of the Diet. He put his marker down. And of course, you're right, the Finance Ministry will, will not put into a document that it submits to the Diet anything that could even approach that declaration. And in so doing, they ended up with now with egg on their faces and now seen as spineless weak, at least at the very top uh, echelons of this, of this otherwise highly reputed organization. Right. A galactic change going on in Japanese politics, including the ministries and how the ministries are handled. You better stay tuned to this because this story isn't over yet. Stay tuned.